since records began in the 1880s, the world's mean temperature has risen by about 0.6 of a degree. It may not sound much, but the heat is definitely on. By the end of the century, experts predict a global rise of a further four degrees. Some maintain the sun is going through a perfectly natural hot phase. After all, the world's climate is always going through phases, from ice ages to far hotter periods. But most environmentalists, at least, claim it's a result of what's known as the greenhouse effect. The heat the sun emits is absorbed by plants and soil and is reflected back towards space. Like the glass walls of a greenhouse, the Earth's atmosphere traps heat and stops it escaping. Carbon dioxide, or CO2, is the most important greenhouse gas in the atmosphere. Since the Industrial Revolution, the atmospheric concentration of CO2 has increased 30%. Today, around 6 to 7 billion tonnes of carbon are emitted every year from power stations, homes, factories and cars. Alongside this, forests, which naturally absorb CO2 for photosynthesis, are also shrinking. Large-scale logging and climate change itself are rapidly reducing the world's great forests. So while more CO2 is being emitted, less is being absorbed. It's the steady and rapid increase in the amount of CO2 in our atmosphere that is, scientists believe, causing global warming. <laughs>